2,000 episodes. Let's talk about that. Good Mythical Morning! And Good Mythical Summer! And Good Mythical 2,000 Episodes! We did it, everybody! We did it! 2,000! I mean, who would have thought that this little idea of ours would turn into 2,000 episodes and counting? Now, for a little perspective, if the average episode of Good Mythical Morning is about 15 minutes long, and we're saying it is, that is 30,000 minutes of mythicality. You could attach a computer to the Orion space capsule, we're thinking about doing it, okay. that will be orbiting the moon later this year, hit play as it blasts off into space, and it would still be playing GMM just as it began to re-enter the Earth's atmosphere. And then it would burn up. Right. Oh, my freaking sequins. Oh no, and that's an expensive suit. My freaking sequins are like no, no. fluffing off of each other. But it would burn up. It would. Which, which. Uh, Don't think about it that way. Yeah, that's not, yeah, not the really. The show's not gonna burn good. up. I'll give you another analogy. 30,000 minutes is the length of one story from mythical kitchenier Trevor at a company holiday party conducted over Zoom. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 We love you, Trevor. Yeah, that, I mean, it was a. Uh, it was a long story. I mean, he, you know, he had a lot of details to cover, and he was like, you're all here, I might and as it, well just go into all of them. There was a lot of build up. Yeah, a lot of setup. And then it just kinda, yeah, yeah, yeah. it was kinda like, Strapping a laptop to the outside of a spacecraft. Yeah, there was kind of burned well, out. Well, there was a beginning and a middle, but there was not an end. <laughs> Thanks, Trevor. <laughs> okay, back when we celebrated a th our 1,000th episode, we thought that was a big deal. Right, uh huh. And we've doubled it. But uh, at the time, we took a look at some of the show's most memorable moments. You know, we did the whole montage thing. So we're not doing a montage this time. Yeah, we are. We yeah, gotta do another montage. Right. We gotta we gotta sit back and watch and reflect on all the unbelievable things that have have happened since then over the last thousand episodes. Right, and we have not seen this. We've only lived it. But let's take a look. Good morning. I think I just sailed freaking for a night. Oh, I immediately grabbed my own crotch. Get it, lad. Oh, God. Oh, God. 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 Oh, you're so big. I am Link, and I am the Serpent King. Link is the Serpent King. Link is me. I declare my love for Rihanna. Whoa. Oh. 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 No, no, it's just hockey. You know, I play with this as a child. <laughs> <laughs> oh, stop! Stop! <laughs> I got an orb in my left ear. Sorry. Oh! Ow! <laughs> Oh my god! Where is it? Where is it? I'm sorry. It's in my ear. Hey, imagine if this is the first one of these videos someone ever watched. <laughs> I'll join the bandwagon. Will it penis? I mean, <laughs> have you seen it? Want him to see your wiener? Yeah. They'd shared first girlfriends and first kisses. So why was a jar of peanut butter any different? It's a lot different! <laughs> Can you smell the cheese? Oh, the cheese is wafting. Whoa, it smells better. It really is wafting. <laughs> <laughs> Can you smell the cheese? Oh, oh, the cheese is wafting. Oh, 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 I freaking told you! I got 71! Oh, yeah! Make it count. You can do it. I hate 
to ask you to do this, but can you pee into my mouth? Take a knee, son. Wow. Nothing wrong with this. What a classy show. Hey, yeah. we got class. We do. But I will say that during about 70 to 80% of that, I was just going. <laughs> yeah. And then realizing it was me, I was like half of it. And then yeah. you know, it made it worse. I was like, oh, who are, oh, I'm one of those guys. I mean, it, Ugh. so much of what we do tends to blur together. Did Hold something on. just oh, fall? Gosh. Is that, uh, is that NAR240? What was that? NAR240 has NAR2 shown up for the 2000th episode. After, Thank you for joining after us. After going into hiding for so long? He's back. Ah, thank you for being here. Please S don't harm us. Seeing it in rapid succession like that, uh, it just, yeah, it does put it in perspective. We do important work. We also, <laughs> we also get up, scream and spin and run. A lot. We are, we're happy guys. Yeah. Yeah, there's, there needs okay. to be more spinning and running in our lives. Guys, we, we there's a lot of happy guys here. The whole whole crew is extremely excited and proud to see the show reach 2,000 episodes, except for maybe Trevor. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. Yeah, but yeah. there is a, another group of people out there who are also pretty proud of you guys, and uh, they have a little something to say too. Hey, Rhett and Dad. Congratulations on 2,000 episodes. Congratulations. Congratulations, guys, on your 2,000th episode. 2,000 episodes. That's crazy. You've been doing this for like almost 10 years now. Thought you would have quit by now. Kind of hope you did. Just kidding, just kidding. <laughs> Congratulations on 2,000 episodes of Good Mythical Morning. We are super proud of you guys and feel like it's been a huge honor to... Um, hear all the stories from so many people around everywhere, um, just how Good Mythical Morning has helped. Oh, I'm God. so proud of you two for your celebrating your 2000th episode. If a visitor from the future had come to me 20 some odd years ago when we met and fell in love, Rhett, and said, listen, I just want to warn you, he's going to make a living with Link on the internet eating various animal testicles. I think I would have thought two things. One, this totally checks out. And two, where do I sign up? Cause that sounds awesome. And it has been. I think that the first episode of Good Mythical Morning probably happened around midnight on an April evening in 1993 when we prank called the next door neighbors and you began to learn what it meant to talk about nonsense for several minutes at a time. <laughs> and that has blossomed into a wonderful show. Uh, I remember watching the Facebook song and my grandma Carolyn saying, that's your cousin. And I thought it was so cool. Congratulations on your 2000th episode of Good Mythical Morning. Who would have thought that two guys <laughs> doing videos in a basement in Lillington, North Carolina, with no employees, would someday end up in La La Land with their own studio and, what, 75 to 100 employees and 2,000 videos. And it's so good that somebody like you two could do this like you've been together all your life and that it's fun and makes a lot of people laugh. We're really, really excited for you guys. Congratulations. We, we love, love you. you. Keep up the hard work. Happy birthday. Merry Christmas. Uh, congratulations. I love you. <laughs> love you. Love you guys. Congratulations. Love you. You guys are the best guys. I'm so proud of everything you've accomplished. I love you guys so much. You boys, should I say. I'm so proud of y'all. Congratulations. I love you. You keep doing what you're doing and we're proud of you. Rhett, as my number two son, I love you very much. Link, I, you're like a son to me as well. And I love you very, very much also. Congratulations, guys. Love y'all. <laughs> that was very sweet, but I am worried your dad might be being held hostage somewhere. <laughs> I, I, that, that was my I, dad. I think that he is being forced <laughs> to make a video, and we need to stop what we're doing right now, <sighs> and we need to go to a jungle somewhere <sighs> and rescue him. Okay? Uh, 
Oh, that was super sweet. Uh, <laughs> we, yeah, we, we the, the next 1,000 episodes are going to be trying to find Yeah, right, yeah. Next episode. He's in a jungle. We're, we're on a plane with a compass. Uh, well, I mean, that was super sweet. Uh, I know I have two other kids that did not come through on that montage. I don't know where they yeah, were. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got to talk to them. I'm coming for them. Uh Wow, that was uh Thank you to everybody who participated. Sweet. Yeah, I mean I mean that was uh it's very sweet. A lot of love. Yeah, and it's, Did you instruct all them to say I love you or did this all happen to say I love you? Because I felt very loved. Just tell us it was impromptu. Well, you don't have to hear about the pre production. Okay. Process. Well, I felt very, very loved and very appreciated. Yeah, and you know, they're 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 our support structure. Mm -hmm. Especially Christy and Jesse. So it's yes. you know, it's I I mean none of this none of this would have ever started if it wasn't for uh, our our family support, so it's uh, it's uh, I moved. Uh, I'm sure it's only going to get more moving as we go. Oh, really? Um, now, back in 2016, we released a limited edition 1,000th episode bronze coin, uh -huh. which we have heard that people apparently fight about uh, on eBay. And now, in celebration of 2,000 episodes, we're releasing another. Limited edition coin it's to just add a to the collection. It's just a, you can get it anywhere. This time. Nope. It's silver. Oh, yes. Look, Look at, at that. that. I'm going to do like they do on Ooh. coin TV. I watch those infomercials. I mean, you see a coin like that, you want it. But the thing is with this one, th this is commemorative. It's only available for basically the release week of this episode, so uh, we want it to be something special for everyone who's experiencing this celebration along with us pretty much in real time. So it's only gonna be available through July 30th. You can go to mythical.com to get this thing. Commemorate the fact that you are a part of this milestone as it happened. If you're watching within this week, go get it, mythical.com, all right? Okay, looks good. I got one too. Uh, all right, now it's time for the celebration cake. Uh huh. Uh, and what would a cake on the show be without a little bit of misguided indulgence? Uh, yeah, we tasked the mythical crew uh, with a mission. We said, here's $2,000. Don't come back until you've spent it all on the most mythical cake that money can buy. And uh, I hope you guys came through. Trevor, I know you're standing over there. Oh, ready to push something in. Oh, the official my. GMM 2000th episode, $2,000 cake of mythicality. Look at all these references. I mean, we got. Well, is this even a real, a real cake? This is a real cake. It's all I don't legitimately. Wanna, I don't want to touch it yet, though. I mean, we've got an oh, axe. Well. We've got a cockroach here. We've got the Furby Ge destroyed by the guillotine. Yeah, we got the Orbeez that went in your ear. There's the ear. The peep. Wade Boggs has gotten prominent placement. <laughs> yeah, he has. Uh, the bowling ball from the fire bowling episode. Now, we gotta cut this thing, and Link, you know what? I'll use this ax right here. You've been a, you know, hold on, first of all, you're not allowed to hold knives, but you know what? You can do it. Maybe in the second millennia that we just finished up with Good Mythical Morning, maybe the new millennium mm -hmm. will be about you being able to have knife privileges. Is it rubber? Seems to be metal, but it is like a butter knife. So Thank you do you, the man. honor. Um, I feel like if I hit that, it will crack open. Cut a corner off this of the back. This is absolutely amazing. Cut a corner off the back and then slide it onto this thing. A corner? You like, like, a, like a, a, well, a I just, icing piece? I don't want to destroy it too much. First thing I get to cut on this show officially, and I have no clue where to. Just cut a corner. Oh, yeah, it is cake. Look at that. Oh, it's a, it's a, it's Look a, at that. Look how thick. And then it's I'm got some get, thick walls. I'm going to get me a piece. Now, this cake was made by exactly. Lacey, who's David's roommate. Now, you can check out. Oh. That almost went into his mouth and into his brain, and that would have been it. Well, there's a freaking. All right, that's it. You don't get. That's it. That was there's it. There's a that, tripping hazard. That was down your here. knife privileges. You got it. Take it back away, okay? Maybe when we hit 3,000, you can get back knife privileges. Your Again. dad loves me. Um, as that, much as very, he loves very you. Sweet. That was very From sweet. my dad, wasn't it? Seemed to be um, equal. Uh, you can check out her work on Instagram at Cakes by Lacey. So thank you, Lacey, for taking the time to make us this. You know, well, let's not promote it until we taste it. <laughs> well, that could, okay. get, that could get awkward. Just no, that's good. It's David's roommate. It's good. You know what I like to do when I'm eating cake? Oh. Uh, 
I just like to sob uncontrollably, which is why we have another surprise for you. Because there's a group of people that we all would not be here oh. without. And it's the Mythical Beasts. Of course. Mm -hmm. And so the Mythical Beasts had a little something that they wanted to say to you guys and the crew. Um, so let's take a look. Good Mythical Morning! Good Mythical Morning! Good Mythical Morning! And happy 2000 episodes! Cheers to you guys on making 2000 episodes. I know you guys say that the show would never last without the fans, but the fans would never be there if you guys didn't create this amazing content. GMM has been more than just a show to me. You guys and the Time Mythical crew are the reason why I wake up more excited than ever. That every day I get to wake up and watch something amazing. A place I can tune into every morning and know when the episode's over, I'll have a smile on my face. It's that 50 minutes of the day where I can just feel quirky and feel like part of a massive family. Good Mythical Morning is just embracing mythicality and just being yourself no matter who is watching. To never lose your sense of wonder, to ask why not, and to lead with love. But also expressing our inner weird through any way possible and nothing negative getting in the way. It has taught me to love and accept who I am. GMM means to me um, hope because I started watching uh, when I was in hospital and it's all I could watch. GMM means waking up every day knowing that I have two dads to make me laugh when I didn't necessarily have one in real life. The show to me reminds me of my friend Charlie. He's a Marine down uh, over in Japan right now serving. Um, so it kind of brings me closer to him in these hard times. This is my older brother, Ben. He passed away in 2019. And we used to watch Threat and Link videos together when we were younger. So it's really important for me to stick with GMM because it's a connection. If I'm in what seems like a very long and dark tunnel, GMM is a beacon of light at the end of it. Replacing all the sad, weird, anxious thoughts in my head with Threat and Link's voices. I have a lot of depression and stuff and you guys just make the world to me and my grandma i love you guys thank you so much no matter how hard my day is gmm brings always laughter in my life whenever i turn on the show i just i can't help but feel happy and i'm so thankful for that it reminds me that everything's going to be all right and red and link are always going to be there we don't know how we would have gotten through the first few months of parenthood without you and i'm so excited to have it as he grows up and we get to watch it together good mythical morning is just the essence of comfort gmm is a safe space gmm is home my daily reminder to always spread love and positivity and kindness every day as a fan of nearly seven years in that time i've realized i was gay and for those that don't really have support around them, seeing you guys show support for all different groups really provides warmth and light, so thank you. I'm transgender, and I love that everyone at Mythical is so supportive of the LGBTQ plus community. It makes me feel loved. As somebody who's gay and grew up in the South, my parents and I haven't always had the best relationship, but we can always talk about good mythical mornings. It's also the first thing my partner and I bonded over, and it even helped me with my proposal a few months ago. GMM to me is the reason I'm engaged to my fiance. I hit his glass and I said, dink it, and then he responded with, and sink it. He knew where it was from, I knew he was the one. My best friends are people that I met through mythical content eight or nine years ago, and I'm very grateful, so thank you. I think the majority of us will never get the opportunity to experience a friendship like the one you guys have. It even inspired me to start my own YouTube channel with my best friend. Thank you so much for showing me the value of true friendship and following your creative passions. You boys have inspired me creatively and emotionally with everything you do. If you follow your passions, then happiness will follow. And I've since pursued a lifelong dream of mine and I'm still walking that road today. You have catapulted a deep life change for me and I can't thank you enough for all that you do. Good Mythical Morning has been so important to me for so long because I started watching as like a 10 year old. I've been watching for the past seven years, been able to bond with my family over it. And it's somewhere I know I can go for a good laugh even on a rainy day. And you've been part of my daily routine for the past six years. Loved every minute. And I've grown to be so fond of Rhett and Link and the entire Mythical crew. That is the YouTube channel that I watch when I'm taking a poop. Wait, I've taken 2,000 poops? GMM for me is just the best English class because I've learned puns, words, sentences that only exist in this show. And also everything that I know about geography and food in the world. So there's that too. Good Mythical Morning means beans. And I love beans. 
just like Rhett loves wood and Link loves peanut butter. I love Rhett and Link and the whole Mythical crew. Every bit of what you guys do helps me get through a day of delivering the mail and it makes it that much better. Thank you very much. You guys are all awesome. I get up and go to university because of you guys and you've been there throughout majority of my childhood. I cannot thank you enough. Love you. And I just want to say thank you for bringing me so much joy. Thank you so much every day for the laughter and happiness you have brought me. For having the longevity of two decades of the internet, you guys are truly the champion, not a sponsor, duo of YouTube. And it's hard to imagine what YouTube would be for me without team. And you guys just make every day so much better. Thank you, Red Link. Thank you, thank you. Thanks for everything you guys do. I love your content. Keep making it. And congratulations. Happy 2000 episode. Happy 2000 episode. Happy 2000th 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 episode. Yes, 2000 more. Okay, I'm going to need a moment. <laughs> I'm going to go join your dad in the jungle. <laughs> yeah. Thank you all for that. Um, it's amazing. And I know we were only, I mean, it, it, based on that, it seems like we were only able to use a little bit of everybody's video. So I know there was a lot of incredibly heartfelt things that were said. And yeah. uh, we were able to capture a fraction of those. Um, means a lot. Yeah. Uh, thank you uh, for 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 being a part of this and you know it's 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 just it's 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 so surreal to you know every time that we're reminded and there's we you know it's it's not just in milestones like this but it's in letters and if we if we travel or if we see somebody on the street or uh tweets or um uh, conversations on the mythical society it's you know you just see how much this show and our friendship and our friendships and this work environment and um, the community that extends through the lens to you and to the friends that and connections that you've made. It's just, uh, as, as we were starting the show, it's just not something that we were, th I mean, we just didn't know it, it could happen. Right, so it's and we it, had no idea that there would be a, a a connection like this. We had we definitely had no idea that um, the things that we were thinking about talking about and the things that, definitely the things that we were thinking about doing and and have done um, would uh, be seen in the way that they've been seen by the mythical beast and to, and to be appreciated. Uh, it, there's just there's a lot of depth that. that um, we didn't anticipate and we didn't intend that you have kind of drawn out of the show. And it's relationship, right? I mean, it's, uh, it's, I mean, it's not something that needs to be broken down and explained here, but I, do, yeah. but I do know it's about a relationship that goes through a lens and that's actually, uh, it means something. It means something on the other side. And we only know that because we've heard it back from you, so. And yeah, and, um, you, and it wasn't, you know, you, that montage was, was incredible, but you guys are also, uh, we hear that from you. Um, you're very vocal in how much you appreciate what we're doing, and we appreciate you guys, and it's a beautiful, symbiotic relationship that we couldn't do this without you. Yeah, and, and you know, we'll give a shout out to the Mythical crew. We, you know, we wanna, we wanna thank you guys yeah. and all the team members who aren't here, but we'll, We'll watch later, but uh, we would we would not be. We've said this a million times, but yeah. I'll say it again. You know, we would not be doing this show if we had if it was the two of us just doing it. Yeah, you know, there was only so much that we could do. We we ran out of runway pretty early. <laughs> yeah, uh, but we have an incredible team that has uh, enabled the show not just to continue, but to flourish and to grow and evolve and change and get better. Uh, and be something that we can kind of step into and make as a team. So thank you to the yeah the crew as well. All of you guys, thank you so much, Stevie. Thank you specifically uh, for for your voice and how your voice comes through, not just in the practical heard way on the show, but it is a but lovely much voice. Much more than that, you know. It, it is saying. the woman with the lovely voice, as uh, has been stated. And uh, you know what? Thank you. 
Brett, thank you, Link, for being my friend. Hmm. Anytime. <laughs> you know what I think we should do? Uh, I do know. As is maybe a tradition at this point. Look at us. Two dudes behind one desk. When I look to my right, I see you. And I see you when I look to my left. Hashtag blessed. We've done so many things on this show. So many things that have helped us grow. We've eaten guinea pig balls and blood pancakes. Yeah, to get the views, we'll do whatever it takes. We built a guillotine and cuddled with the queen. Did it in our live stream and saw how long we could pee. And I saw your junk when we plucked our pubes. And you waited till now to tell me. They've been good, and they've been mythical, and they've been in the morning, unless you didn't watch it in the morning, which is totally cool. Just think of all the crap we've done. I even went and grew this sweet man bun. That bag of flour to my face really stung. But you soothe yourself with our heat activated mug. Let's not make this song about our merch. About our hats, stickers, joggers, hoodies, and shirts. It's about this connection with the mythical beast. It feels so good that it almost hurts. We shared 2,000 mornings, and they've been good. And they've been mythical, and they've been a morning, depending on the time zone. We shared 2,000 mornings. Thanks for subscribing and clicking that bell. You know what time is. Hey boys, I'm Josh's lower back tattoo. Congrats on the 2000th episode of GMM. It's time to spin the wheel of mythicality. Did it, did it pop at the end? Uh, yeah, I, there booty was something. Pop? Something happened to the tattoo at the that, very end that, that disturbed was, me a little that bit. That was Trevor's voice. Uh, click. Surprise it wasn't longer. <laughs> oh! <laughs> you know, it's his, it's his birthday today. Oh. Happy birthday, Trevor. Click the top link to see if we can identify a real episode of GMM from a fake one. <laughs> yeah, there's been a lot in good mythical more. Celebration continues. Click through to find out where the Will of Mythicality is going to land. Order the limited edition 2000th episode coin available now through July 30th at mythical.com.